I am so excited to be back on YouTube and sharing some new tutorials with you. Um, today we are going to talk about how to create digital online mock-ups and um, this is a great way to get your product out there really quickly without having to make tons of physical products to to photograph and so if you're a sign maker and um, you want to share new ideas or come up with new things to put online very easily and quickly this tutorial is for you so let's get started I'm going to show you how to make a mock-up without any expensive software or any design background. This can be done truly by anyone using your smartphone. Um, I have an iPhone, so that's what you'll be seeing me do this on, and a free online program called Canva. So the first thing you need to do is take an actual picture of your product. And as you can see here, I've laid out on my garage floor a frame. I don't even have the, the back of my my sign fully attached as you can see but i just laid it on top of each other because again this is for a mock-up purposes so i have a frame with good lighting overhead and i stood on a step stool so that i could get a, a real straight on overhead shot of my blank sign once you have your photo you want to open it in your smartphone so the first thing i'm going to do is make sure that it's straight there's a straightening tool right at the beginning and so i'm going to just make sure that this looks straight it gives me a little grid and i'm just going to tilt this until it looks like the edge of the frame is aligned with one of the lines on the grid so once i have that straight now i'm ready to crop it so you can press the little crop button down here and then as you can see, I'm gonna crop the sides in pretty close to the frame. And I'm just gonna bring this, keep bringing this all the way in until I have my frame nice and cropped so that I'm just seeing the frame and none of the garage floor. Okay, so now I have my bare frame. And now I'm gonna work a little bit on the color Again, the built-in editor on the iPhone has some great color tools um, that I'm just gonna play around with until I get the look that I want. And so once I stop sliding these around and I get the color that I'm really looking for, then I am ready to send this to my computer. So the first thing I'm gonna do is open up a website called canva.com. This is a completely free website. There is a premium version, but um, to do what you wanna do, really you can just use the free version. And um, I know that I want a square photo and there's all sorts of templates that you can pick from. Um, and so I encourage you to really explore this tool. So I'm gonna choose a square template. Um, I'm gonna erase everything that's already kind of pre-built on that template. Then I'm gonna go over here to the side, to my uploads, and I've already done the work of uploading a, a few photos um, that I think would be good backgrounds for my mock-up. So now I'm gonna go over to the text, and what's cool about Canva is it's got all sorts of pre-laid out text that I can play around with. I can put my own words in here. I can edit the, the font if I want. Let's just pull in a few of these different texts and see what we come up with. Um, here's one that is really cute, this farm to table. Um, boy, this would make an adorable sign um, in somebody's farmhouse. Here's, let's see, here's another one that is like an established sign. Um, established signs are so popular right now. So you can see I'm just gonna, this dapper could be someone's last name. So I'm gonna just kind of start to play around with the, the layout of this. I'm gonna change the font, change the font sizes, maybe do a center alignment instead of um, a left-hand alignment, and you can see the tools up here at the top are really easy to work with. It's really similar to working in uh, Microsoft Word or PowerPoint. Um, it's just really user-friendly. And so as I am kind of dragging things around and seeing, like, look at that, that's an adorable sign. The Dapper family established 2012. So let's do another one. Um, here we go, love, peace, and joy. Um, from the Fitzgeralds. This is so cute. I could see this being an adorable sign at Christmas time. 
um, a really cute layout. So um, I, I come and play around with these when I'm just even having a design block. Um, I like to do my own design in Illustrator, but um, sometimes just looking at the layouts of these text uh, really get my creative juices flowing. And so you can see how many they have. It's just loads and loads of them. So um, once I feel like I've got a design that I like, I can download that image from the top here. And so I'll just download it as a JPEG. And um, now it is saved to my computer and you can see it here. Now it's ready to upload to Etsy or uh, my website or social media as a new sign that I am offering. So definitely take advantage of these tools. This is a great way to rapidly go to market with lots of different designs without having to physically make the product and upload it um, and, and do a photo shoot every time you have a new product or design idea. So I hope that's helpful to you guys. Um, be sure to check us out on Instagram. That is where we do a lot of uh, behind the scenes of our own business and interact with a lot of you. And then also, if you are an Etsy seller or are thinking about being an Etsy seller, we have an Etsy course that we have created to train other Etsy shops on how to be successful. It goes from everything from creating your listings to um, setting up your shop and how to start making money today. So I hope that was helpful. Be sure to comment and subscribe and we will catch you hopefully next week.